Hi and welcome back. Today I'm going to show you a little tip with voiceover uh, on the Mac. It's something I've used occasionally just to record a quick bit of audio to go into a video that I'm doing or something. It's just the easiest, quickest way to get something sorted. Trouble was, I couldn't work out how to get the audio files out of voiceover. Um, and I did a bit of research on the internet and people are saying, oh yeah, you can go to this directory and find it and do this, that and the other. And it wasn't until I was having one of my idiot moments that I suddenly tried something really, really simple and it worked. So this tip is for you. If you've been searching for an easy way to get that out, I'm going to show you now. So if we go over to VoiceOver here, we've got our little test piece. Literally, just drag it into the folder that you want. And there it is, M4A. Perfect. Nowhere told me that. I had to go and figure it out just for trial and error, but I couldn't find any help anyway. It's probably so simple, they don't think anyone needs to know. Obviously, I did. The other thing that is worth considering is, in preferences, you've got audio quality. I've got it set to lossless. It's defaults to compressed. It would be worth changing that. You can change off the location-based naming as well, if you want. It would be worth changing that to lossless so that you can use it properly um, without any degradation in your audio stream. Hope that little quick tip solved the problem for you. If it did, thumbs up, really appreciate it. Subscribe if you want to see any other future tips. Great to have you on board. Look forward to seeing you all soon.